Yo, what is up, guys? Coming at you with a brand new, not Black Ops 2, this is Advanced Warfare. This guy gets a uh, DNA bomb with the Morse. Check this guy out. I'll put his link in the description below. But uh, as you look at the title of this video, it says, um, broke as fuck. <laughs> yes, I am broke. Ah, you know what? I decided in myself, I'm going to get an Elgato. And then I'm going to get a blue snowball. All right? Not talking about those snow cones you see at the fair with the giant clown staring at you. I'm talking about this recording device. It's a giant microphone and you speak into it and it speaks back to you. It's crazy. Yeah, I know. But it doesn't just speak back to you. If you, like, send that to somebody else, it'll, like, repeat what you said to them, too. It'll be crazy. So, um, I'm gonna do that. And I'm, I'm only $160 away from getting the Elgato. Yes, you know, uh, about time, I'm gonna do it. I can't, I can't fix my Roxio, and it's not even a pro version, so I'll, like, screw it. I'm just gonna ball out, you know. I'm gonna start selling some of my stuff. I'm gonna do chores and all that stuff. You know how broke I am? I don't even have a door. Oh my, yeah. As you guys know, um, you probably don't. <laughs> Sorry about that. As I know, I don't have a door on my, uh, my room because that's how broke I am. Um, well, it, it originally started out as, oh, Mark, you've been cleaning your room before taking your door. I was like, all right, whatever, you know, like, it, it actually, what actually happened is, um, my mom's door, it, it broke because, uh, someone punched it. It wasn't me, though. It was not my fault, and I didn't do it, all right? But someone punched it, and she needed a new door, and, um, she decided to pull a, uh, old trickaroo on me, and now she has my door, so, uh, I, I'm not... I guess I'm not mad at it. I don't really care. It's a door. Like, what the hell? You know? I'm not, I'm not that big on privacy. Except at school. I hate it whenever I'm, I'm like, changing out or something and someone's like, Hey, let me tickle your ball sack. I'm like, dude, no. Gross. Fifty shades of gay, man. Seriously. Fifty shades of gay. Um, well, this is a, this is a really good gameplay. I gotta say, guys. <laughs> He, he's kind of campy a little bit, but that's all right, you know? Um, but he, what he does, though, is, is truly amazing. He's a sniper, all right? And he gets a uh, MLG score streak, all right? So he's a major league sniper, so he's an MLS. That's going to be a thing. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm going to put that in the uh, description. MLS, the new MLG. <laughs> be really cool. And, uh, what do you guys think about this Black Ops 3 thing going on? I mean, it's kind of cool, right? Yeah. I, uh, I gotta tell you guys, I hated Black Ops 2 when it came out, because I didn't have it. And then as soon as I saw what it looked like, I was like, holy shit, I'm getting my, my ass on this, you know? And then, uh, that was the last time I ever, uh, loved the Call of Duty. Um, but I, I don't have Advanced Warfare, might, might I just say. So, uh, the last Call of Duty I ever got was Ghost. And, uh, oh my god, I got to tell you guys this. So, um, I bought Ghost for, like, uh, I want to say a hundred. No, not a hundred dollars. Around, like, sixty or seventy dollars. And I I had it for, like, the longest time, you know. And not not for, like, the longest time. I want to say, like, three months in, I was like, screw this. Because no one else really played it. And it was, like, it was a new game and all that, but still... It was pretty trashy, and I mostly played Black Ops 2, or like, I don't know, I played like, Yo 2, or uh, let's say, let's just say I played a lot of Half 2, Half 2, I actually had this whole dedicated world, and I lost it in my thumb drive, but what ended up happening with uh, Ghost was I actually sold it, and uh, alright, so I walk into GameStop, and I'm all like, alright, cool. Uh, can I get my money back for this crappy game, please? And the chick at the store, well, it was actually a chick, I know, right? Crazy. You know, the chick at the counter, she's like, no, it, it, the best we can do is $6. I was all like, I will take it. <laughs> I walked out of that GameStop with $6 and a receipt to say, you made a big mistake. And that's how I lost like uh, $60, you know? I, uh, sold it for six dollars like i still have the receipt around here but we moved so i probably don't have it anymore 
that. So, uh, yeah, I mean, just take my word for it. Probably, uh, my, my friend Alex will probably back me up and, uh, Jeff, but... So, also, I gotta say, I want to talk about this city for a little bit. We have, like, 20 seconds left. Alright, so, I had this huge city, right? I was gonna build, like, a Hunger Games and all this stuff. And the Hunger Games was gonna have, like, four domains. It's gonna be, like, city. We have to do a lot of parkour. Um, a whole bunch of other stuff. And, yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. I lost it. I lost what I was talking about. And I lost the thumb drive. So, I uh, hope you guys subscribe and have a good day, you know? Peace.